Now, the Pakistani rupee has dived to a historic low against the US dollar on Thursday after an exchange cap was lifted. This is the biggest one day drop in over two decades. The currently cash trapped Pakistan government relaxed its grip on the exchange rate in a bid to unlock a vital bailout from the IMF. The Pakistani rupee dropped by 24 rupees in one day to end at 255 versus the dollar. Pakistan's economy is currently tanking and foreign exchange reserves are at a record low with only enough left to pay for around three weeks of the imports. In 2019, former Prime Minister Imran Khan brokered a multi-billion dollar loan package from the IMF, but the economy slid backwards when Khan took measures to cushion against the cost of living crisis. Khan's successor, Shabazz Sharif, has also been reluctant to meet the loan conditions amid falling popularity. The latest measure means that inflation is bound to rise further in the South Asian nation. Yes, undoubtedly. You see, what has happened is that the Pakistani economy has tanked. There have been several problems. The first, of course, has been the floods. The second is economic mismanagement. And thirdly, the fact that so much money is being given to the armed forces and to aid terrorism, there is no money left to our economic growth for any kind of investment. So as a result, there is huge unemployment. There is absolutely uh, a chaotic situation as far as the economy is concerned because there has no, been no investment there has been no economic progress over the years with the pakistani government taking large chunks of money uh, out of the economy for the military there is no money left and after that you have had floods you've had other problems leading to the fact that the Pakistani economy is tanking. Mm -hmm. And a clear example of that is the fact that it, the Pakistani rupee is 250 rupees to the dollar.